the Meraki MT-10 is a completely cloud-managed sensor. It is epic. It measures temperature and humidity, and you can monitor the readings without even being on site. Here are three reasons why the MT-10 is awesome. Number one, ease of deployability. Have you ever connected your phone to your car using Bluetooth? Maybe you have AirPods, which allow you to wirelessly connect and enjoy music or podcasts. But what if I told you that connecting the MT-10 to the Meraki dashboard network was literally this easy? Well, it is. And to put it in perspective, even my mum could figure out how to set up the MT-10 sensor. And let me tell you, she is not a tech whiz. And as for the physical installation, that's easy too. Just peel and stick the tabs, which are included in the box, and you're good to go. And if you want a tighter fit, then a wall mount, along with screws and easy instructions are included in the box as well. Number two, data accuracy. Here's something which might surprise you. The data that we can gather from this little thing is pretty powerful. The accuracy of the temperature is to the nearest 0.3 degrees Celsius. And the humidity has just a 2.5% margin. And not only do we get individual readings automatically pulled into the cloud, but we also get weekly reports so we can start to see trends of temperature and humidity. And we can quickly diagnose where and when problems are occurring. Number three, dashboard integration and easy alerting. So as we just spoke about, the data that we gather from the sensor is really powerful. We can look back to see how to improve our physical environment. But what's the one thing that's even better than looking back and seeing how and why and when problems occurred? I'll tell you what's better being alerted about those problems so we can deal with them in real time. And guess what? Alerting is included in the Meraki dashboard. As soon as a particular temperature or humidity threshold is crossed, we can trigger a notification through phone, email, text message, WebEx Teams, or even a webhook triggering another action entirely. For example, we could link sensor alerts to a webhook which turns on the air conditioning or opens a window anytime the temperature crosses, say, 24 degrees Celsius. Now that is what I call a smart space. If you want to get your hands on some of these epic sensors, go to cs.co slash get sensors right now. Mm -hmm.